I know it's still the same stuff about Yasuke and they're doubling down on it. Yeah, I know Ubisoft responded to you. Oh, he's just uh, inspiring, neg- uh, cr- creating negativity. But y- you guys were asking for it. Sh- shut up. You guys know what you were doing when you made that. You- this could have yeah. easily been like, you could have just put in a Japanese dude and people would be super hyped for it right now instead of dividing people like what you did right as of this moment. And yeah, yeah. I, 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 I watched a video, was it last night or this morning? Like the other character, Nawe, but they're right. Nawe is a male name. So it's like I played, I played Samurai Warriors and Nawe is a male character. So they're right. <laughs> no, it's not a female name. It's, it's a male. It's a male. Name. Maybe, maybe she, she's going trans. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That, maybe, what... maybe she's, she's, yeah. she's cutting off her, yeah. her, her skin. Making it another dick, right? Right, it's like she, she does kind of have like that male features, even though she's female. If you look at the trailer, yeah. yeah. All right, so right over here, let's go ahead and bring up that article. Right over here, some PC gamer Assassin's Creed Shadows executive producer says Elon Musk is just feeding hatred with his reaction to the game's black protagonist. Uh, Musk claimed that the use of historical figure was part of an initiative that kills art, which is n- he's not wrong. Right, I'm not gonna go ahead and like read everything, but I do want to read what Elon Musk said. So, uh, let's see. Uh, let's go ahead, and I think it's right over here on right on May 24th. Elon Musk decided to throw his opinions into the mess, replying to a tweet about a game with DEI kills art. DEI stands for diversity, equity, and inclusion, and it's it is a policy and that organizations can use to promote equal treatment and involvement of all people, especially people who are usually underrepresented. It isn't exactly a nuanced take. That tweet generated emotions that the first thing I wanted to do is go back on X that I had deleted and just tweet back. Said, uh, Cootie? <laughs> I don't know how to say that. Uh, for me, Elon, it's sad. He's just feeding hatred. I had a lot of three word re- replies that came came to mind, but he didn't reply to Musk. By attacking someone like Musk, Sorry, uh, like Elon, I will not convince people about our point of view as a team. So here's the thing. Elon Musk is just another drop in the bucket of how stupid this game is. Yeah. It's because if you actually go to Grums on X, he says, one of Japan's biggest YouTubers, Hiabetsu Human, slams Ubisoft Assassin's Creed Shadows for 40 minutes in his video. Quote, the discomfort I felt as towards Assassin's Creed Shadows by a Japanese person linked in the reply. So there's a long thing, and it's actually translated. Assassin's Creed Shadow has been in the state of uproar after Elon Musk criticized it uh, with developer uh, uh, UBI responding. The uh, okay, okay, to me, Elon Musk is a sad character. He just promotes hatred, which is all the same thing, right? In conclusion, Elon will come uh, come to the gaming world. So if you actually Click on it. It's a 40 minute link to the, it's it's gonna be a long, long video, right? Now he's looking for and a translator to help all captions in English. Please contact him for fire gig. And the thing is that look at how many views this person is getting. 250,000 views two days yeah. ago for Japanese language videos. This is nuts. Yeah, the Japanese audience is seeing this yeah. game is racist and anti-Japanese game. That is it. And the thing is, I believe they're even doing a um what uh Yasuke statue. Yeah. Right. Uh, figure and uh, collector's edition. Wrong. That's wrong. They right? got wrong. Yeah, they got wrong. All right. Let me see if I can find that. I want to bring that because that's actually really yeah, important. I, 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 I also watched Hypnotics live stream. Uh, I I, re, I rewatched the um I watched the stream yesterday. He was playing the soundtracks released by Assassin's Creed Shadows. At first, it sounded very Japanese soundtrack, but then it goes it goes hardcore on the. It's kind of like black like hip hop, right? Yeah, black hip hop. Yeah, it becomes like super hip hop or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, let me see if I can find it. Um, we, yeah, we can yeah, actually but, play it here a little bit. Yeah, it's it's um it's pretty bad, right? Okay, uh, so so here's a collector's edition. I'm going to show over here. So here's a collector's edition, and I believe there is a post that shows how this is all incorrect right people who are (laughs) (laughs) pre-ordering 
<laughs> oh man but uh but yeah so it's um i'm not sure how 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 white people are like so crazy about it but the, the thing is i believe people are actually saying see wrong kanji character those are the same character but one is written incorrectly so this is just one of many things right right uh and it's basically this person going saying that this is incorrect going back so the fact that they're also shitting on the actual kanji letters is pretty bad yeah. and i guess a lot of people will you know there's a lot of people who are actually like you know ubisoft like defenders right like U ubisoft like cock riders or dick suckers right and they will they will play whatever ubisoft releases but how do you feel about like let, 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 like let's say if this is written incorrectly in your language or my language or whatever like it's just sort of like you guys did you guys not do your research yep yeah it's uh it's it's super super cringe yo what's going on epic mike how's it going dude how's it going man hope you're doing well dude hope you're doing well but yeah um but this is this is what i see <laughs> this <laughs> all right <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck man oh shit <laughs> oh man but here's like for me i don't i i i don't really care man i don't i i, I don't really care I, i'm not gonna play yeah. this game i'm not gonna buy it uh great but it's gonna be on game pass right you can play on game pass it's not a uh oh, oh, no are you gonna subscribe to ubisoft plus that is it depends on the release window. Uh, yeah, I like I, I tweeted like I was I planned originally to cover uh what do you call this Star Wars Outlaws, another Ubisoft uh garbage work. But the thing is, two games are coming out very very near it. Number one, Visions of Mana for my main channel. So it's like, it's gonna be it's a mana action game. Looks really good. I, I'm I kind of want to get into it. And the second one, more importantly, Black Myth Wukong. Thanks for checking out this segment of the Project Egg Row podcast. If you like what we do here, please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you will know next time when we go live. We do go live every Saturday at 8 p.m. Once again, we are just getting started. Tons of more video to come. Thanks, and we'll see you guys next time.